So it's interesting, I actually started off as a dentist. I spent several months on uh, an Indian reservation in the public health service. At the end of the summer, I said, you know what? I want to take care of more of the person. And plus, I like to talk a lot, and talk to people, and dentistry would sort of limit me in that regard. In ENT, we're not only a specialty, but we, we do have a sort of general return practice. So we do have patients that almost come to us at many years, it's almost like primary care. And those patients you develop a rapport for, you get to know their family, and sometimes you get to see their children, and for me, for a few patients, grandchildren. So it's, it's exciting from that regard. One of the things that I think that I have, I think I exhibited is, I feel compassionate towards my patients. In fact, back in dental school, it was sort of silly because we had some awards, and there was this one award that it was, I thought it was a silly award. It was the, 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 the Compassion Award. And they brought this award up at graduation, and I, I received it. When my father was there, he said, wow, that was the most important award, because you can be a great doctor, but if you can't be compassionate, then you're missing the boat with patients.